Well, after a Wilson man was murdered in his front yard, neighbors told our crews they were afraid to talk because of increased violence in their community. So we sent CBS 17's Holding Co. Wiki to Wilson to dig deeper into the murder and get answers about what's being done to keep you safe. It's a phrase neighbors uttered over and over in the hours after 63-year-old Everett Earl Artis was shot to death in his front yard. I don't go outside. This door is never unlocked. Things are kind of tough. People are getting really desperate. I brought those concerns here to the Wilson Police Department, but was told that Wilson Police don't do on-camera interviews. However, they did tell me this killing wasn't random. You know, he was by himself, so they knew they could probably get in there and probably do some quick get out. David Barefoot described artists as good as gold, but arrest warrants state that 57-year-old Jimmy Ray Turner and 30-year-old Ashley Nicole Harrell killed him over $30. Man, I wouldn't take nobody's life over a thousand dollars, but it's just $30. You know? Sometimes people just don't think. While the murder wasn't random, it isn't the type of crime people in Wilson come to expect. So every now and then you get a little spill too, right? Here. Wilson hasn't had double-digit homicides since 2005, but neighbors tell me they're concerned this could be the new normal. Things up. And I mean, you, you cannot control the crime rate in America nowadays. That's why Wilson PD says they're working with their federal partners to ensure crimes like this don't happen again. In Wilson, Holding Crew Wiki, CBS 17 News.